dog. Good evening. How are you doing? It's getting cold here. And I just want to tell you something. <clears throat> you know, um, for the last one month, two months, two weeks ago, I was getting very, very sick. And I think I think I told you about it. But by the grace of God, I get better. I'm getting better and I thank God for that. And I it's a testimony that God can heal you all the diseases. That everything is not hard for God not to do. So I love it. I just wanted to keep you um there's a verse I led and it keep me um keep me hope and uh, give me feel that God is still God and I'm so happy that I know that he still lives and I wanted to know this yes I still look the same Christian I pray every day yeah because I'm a child of God I am and you are too so you should believe that each and every day that God is the keeper and he has I just want to tell you this evening. It's Sunday evening and I thank God for giving me this day. Don't worry about the noise. <laughs> this is a noise and um, I just want to tell you God loves you. He never forsake you. No way he did you. No way he did you abandon you. It's like the way you see the changes of the color of the trees. You know, it's like the, the change of colors, you know, the trees change colors. The, you know, it's not like the switching, the, the changing them, the trees change, or leaves change colors. When it comes to winter, there's no tree, there's no leaves. But God doesn't change; He's the same as yesterday, today, and forever. He has never changed. And I want to tell you this: whatever you're sitting down and you're going through a road, and you think that. It's the end of your life or the end of everything. Think twice. Come before God and ask everything you need. Is God who is able to do what no man can do. I believe in him and I, I know God is able to do what no man can do. And, and, and I want to read something about Something I, I want you to know. I just want to make sure I found it the right one because it's good to read the word of God. But I know it says, Ask in the Matthew chapter 7, that is all thing I sing. Ask, I shall be, it shall be given, seek, and you'll find it. Knock the door shall be open for you. Yes, it's, it's not about what you're doing, it's about turning into God, into everything, and giving Him your life. You know, you just give God your life, and that is it. Don't turn on God because He loves you. He gives you uh, life, gives you comfort, you know, and that is God we serve. You know, I want you to give Him that hope, that love, you know, and He will give you the comfort you need so he says you know um this is the first i laid uh, it gives me courage that in uh, isaiah 55 verse 5 that by his stripes we are being healed you don't have to worry about anything just ask god he will give you he will give you the comfort you know when you're troubled things are going wrong you know that is why you have to believe in God because many people they don't trust in God, they don't believe in God, they believe I don't know what they believe in but let me tell you God, you know like the way when the children of Israel they were they were in the desert and there was no food there was no water and they asked they told they, they told they told Moses, why did you brought us to suffer with uh, the, with the uh, with the anger and uh, we can't eat, we, can, we cannot drink, you know? And Moses cried, cried to God, and he told him, just it rained the manna from the heaven, you know? That is how you should think about things. That is how you should 
think about what God can do for you in the midst of everything. He will do you good, you know. And don't worry. God will not forsake you. Now we read with you. That is how it says. So I think you just have to give your life to Christ every time you're thinking of everything. And God will give you comfort, you know. Yes. Every time you're down, read the Bible. Every time you're down, pray. Don't think God has not given you enough. He has given you life. And that is what you should be happy about. That God and praise Him every time. No matter how difficult things might be, He is God. He never fails. And that is how I'm happy about. I hope you'll be blessed. See you around. And I will give you the good news. Read by always and see you. Just go. Just have to go.